now we are going to learn about example number 2 so this equation a is equal to c plus l are very much useful for you look here broad cash 20000 and furniture of 10000 to common to be this so here owner brought 20000 cash so cash comes in cash account effect real account then brought furniture 10000 furniture comes in furniture account effect and as per rules of real account debit what comes in. so here cash and furniture comes in and anything brought in the business by the owner is known as capital so here owner is become giver so capital account credit so we have to make journal entry first so the journal entry of this transaction here cash account debit 20000 furniture account debit 10000 to capital account 20 plus 10 become 30000 now we are able to think about the effect so here cash comes in so cash increased and owner brought in capital in business so capital is also increased so if i cash comes in 20000 so we have the value of cash and capital in this the third comes so here liabilities is become zero 20 plus 10 30 now capital is ready now so bank account debit to cash account 5000 so whenever we deposited 5000 in bank so at that time our bank balance increase so bank balance increased and 5000 cash goes out so cash decrease
so here cash 20000 out of 20000 we deposited 5000 in bank so cash decreased to 5000 so 20000 means 5000 decrease okay 15000 For nature 10,000 and here our time balance increased that is 5,000. Nothing is changed in capital. Capital will change in any way. 30,000. Now nothing is changed in libraries here. 15 plus 10, 25 plus 5, 30,000. Now, goods of 8,000 purchased from Rajesh. So here we purchased the goods, 8,000. So goods comes in purchase account effect, real account, as per rules of real account debit what comes in. So goods comes in the purchase account debit and this goods purchase from Rajesh. So Rajesh is given Rajesh account effect, personal account credit to given. So Rajesh is given. So Rajesh account credit. So 8000. account debit to Rajesh account. So here we purchase the goods. So goods comes in. So goods increased means your stock is increased. Goods increased. And this goods purchase from Rajesh on credit because in this transaction a personal name is given. So whenever a person name is given and cash and check what is not given, so it clearly suggests that here we goods purchase from Rajesh on credit and whenever we purchase the goods on credit, our liability is also increased here. So here cash 15,000, nothing is changed, furniture 10,000, nothing is changed in furniture. Bank balance 5,000. And our liabilities 
8000 next goods of 6000 purchased for cash so here we purchase the goods for cash so whenever we purchase the goods so at that time goods comes in goods of 6000 purchase for cash so here the goods purchase so goods comes in purchase account effect real account and as per rules of real account debit what comes in so goods comes in so purchase account debit 6000 and this goods purchase for cash so cash goes on cash account effect Rules of real account credit what goes out, so cash goes out, so cash account credit, so journal entry that is purchase account debit six thousand to cash account six thousand. So goods purchase, so goods comes in. So goods increased and cash goes out. So cash decreased. Here we have cash fifteen thousand and cash goes out sixteen six thousand. So fifteen thousand minus six thousand cash decrease to nine thousand. Furniture ten thousand. Bank balance five thousand. Stock. Here we have stock eight thousand. And six thousand purchase so goods increased. Eight thousand plus six thousand become fourteen thousand. Nothing is changed in capital. Thirty thousand. And liabilities that is also equal eight thousand. We have to make total here. Nine thousand plus ten thousand nineteen. Nineteen plus five. Twenty-four thousand plus ten. Thirty plus four thousand here. So here our total that is thirty-eight thousand. Now, capital is say thirty thousand, and liabilities say eight thousand. Nothing is changed. So total here. So cash fifteen thousand and six thousand cash decrease fifteen minus six nine thousand furniture nothing is changed ten thousand bank balance five thousand stock eight thousand and here we purchase the goods six thousand so eight thousand plus six thousand fourteen thousand so total asset thirty eight thousand capital thirty. And liability is eight thirty thousand plus eight thousand become thirty eight thousand. So A is equal to C plus L. Now goods of five thousand sold for nine thousand to Raman on credit. So five thousand goods sold to Raman on credit. So when we goods sold to Raman, so Raman is receiver. Raman account effect. 
Es por eso por eso no le cambio de vida de sido. So Ramón es de sido, so Ramón le cambio de vida. And good soul, it means good goes out. Says account effect. As per the so real account credit, what goes on? So good goes on. So sales account credit. So real. Fifth number. Roman account debit to sales account. Total, we have to make total 
of this volume. So cash. So forty two thousand. Here capital thirty four thousand. And our liabilities that is eight thousand. So here we completed our example number two. So today we are going to learn about example number three. Brought one lakh cash and commons a business. So owner brought one lakh cash in business. So cash comes in. Cash account effect. As per rules, so real account debit what comes in, so cash comes in. So cash account debit one way. And in an investment made by the owner, owner to start a business that is called capital. So here owner is giver, capital account effect. And as per rules, so personal account credit to giver. So owner is giver, so capital account credit. So here journal entry. That is cash account debit one lakh. To capital account one lakh. Now effect in our business. So when we brought one lakh cash in business, so cash comes in. So cash increased in our business. Cash increased and one lakh capital brought in business. So capital is also increased in our business. Now our accounting equation that is A is equal to C plus L. A for assets, C for capital, and L for liabilities. So cash increased, and cash is our current asset. So here, cash one lakh. And also increase capital in our business. So capital one lakh. And there is no change in our liabilities, so liabilities become zero here. One lakh capital one lakh zero. Now second transaction. Ten thousand goods purchased from Vivo on credit. So whenever we purchase a goods, ten thousand from Vivo. So purchase a goods means goods comes in. Purchase account effect. As per rules of real account debit, what comes in? So goods comes in. So purchase account debit ten thousand. And this goods purchased from Vivo. So Vivo is Given Vivo account effect as per rules of personal account credit to Vivo, so Vivo is Vivo, so Vivo account credit here. So journal entries or transaction. Purchase account debit to Vivo account ten thousand. So whenever we purchase a goods, so goods comes in. So whenever goods increase, so our stock that is also increase. So first thing here, goods increased, and this goods purchase from Vivo on credit. So whenever we purchase a goods on credit, so our liabilities. Means our creditors is also increase. क्योंकि आपने विपुल से credit में घुस लिया है. 
तो आपको पेमेंट करना बाकी है तो विवो आपके लिए क्रेडिटर्स हो जाएगा अ पर्सन वो प्रोवाइड्स गुड्स और सर्विस ऑन क्रेडिट सो दो पर्सन आर नॉन एज क्रेडिटर्स तो विवो ने आपको क्रेडिट में गुड्स दिया है तो विवो को आपको पेमेंट करना बाकी है तो जब तक वो आप उसको पेमेंट नहीं करोगे तो आपके लिए लाइब्रेटी हो जाएगी क्रेडिटर्स हो जाएगा सो so, यह लाइब्रेरीज इंक्रीज सो कैश इज वन लाइन देर इज नो चेंज इन अवर कैश सो कैश वन लाइन एंड वी आर वी परचेज अ गुड्स सो अवर स्टॉक इज ऑल्सो इंक्रीज क्योंकि जितना परचेस करोगे उतना आपके शॉप में जो स्टॉक है वो इंक्रीज हो जाएगा सो वी हैव अनदर एसेट दैट इज स्टॉक एन थाउजेंड नाउ नथिंग इज चेंज इन अवर कैपिटल लुक दिस कैपिटल में कोई चेंज नहीं है सो कैपिटल दैट इज वन एंड दिस गुड्स परचेस From the own credit, so our liability also increase. Ten thousand our liability increase. So liabilities ten thousand. So we go our creditors that you have to pay me to not pay me. So total. One lakh ten thousand. Capital one lakh. And liabilities ten thousand. So A is equal to C plus L. C for capital one lakh plus ten thousand become one lakh ten thousand. Now third transaction. Two thousand goods region two we move. In previous transaction, we purchase a goods from Vivo, ten thousand. But out of ten thousand goods, two thousand goods return to Vivo. So whenever we goods return to Vivo, so Vivo is receiver. Vivo account effect. As per rules of personal account, debit the receiver. So Vivo is receiver. So Vivo account debit. So in previous transaction, we purchase a goods. Now goods return. So that is purchase return. Goods goes out. Purchase return account effect. As per rules of real account, credit word goes out. So goods goes out. So purchase return account credit. So two thousand goods. Vivo <coughs> account debit two thousand.
capital now one lakh capital there is nothing change in capital same one lakh now liabilities here when we purchase the goods from we at that time ten thousand of liabilities but out of ten thousand we return the goods two thousand so our liabilities decrease two thousand so out of ten thousand two thousand decrease means eight thousand.
they will return goods of rupees one thousand. So they will return the goods of rupees one thousand. So here we put sold to KV on credit. Now KV return these goods. So goods comes in. Sales return account in that. As per rules of legal account, debit what comes in. So goods comes in. So sales return account debit. And these goods return from KV. So KV is given KV account effect. And as per Rules of personal account credit the giver. So giving is giver. So giving account credit here. So sales return account debit one thousand to giving account. One thousand. So Kevin returned his goods out of his one thousand. When we goods sold to Kevin on credit, so at that time all debtors in this will be able to pay salary now. Now Kevin returned his goods. So our debtors decrease to be ten thousand, five thousand, maybe one thousand. Those they return for the year. So our debtors increase will be there, and goods comes in. So goods comes in means our stock is also increased here. So sales return one thousand goods comes in. So goods increased and debtors decreased. Cash nothing is changed in our cash. One lakh. पहले आपके पास थ्री थाउजेंड का स्टॉक था अब केवी ने गुड्स रिटर्न कर दिया सो वन थाउजेंड गुड्स इंक्रीज थ्री थाउजेंड उसमें तो वन थाउजेंड का रिटर्न मिला सो नाउ वी हैव गुड्स फोर थाउजेंड डेटर्स सो योर डेटर्स इज फाइव थाउजेंड बट आउट ऑफ फाइव थाउजेंड केवी रिटर्न द गुड्स वन थाउजेंड so 5000 minus 1000 now we have 4000 so 5000 me se 1000 se return kar diya so debtors ho jayenge aapke 4000 now nothing is change in our capital one line Nothing is changed in our liabilities. Now total one lakh eight thousand. Capital one lakh. And liabilities that is eight thousand. Now the last transaction here. One thousand furniture purchased for cash. So here we purchase a furniture for cash. So whenever we purchase a furniture, the furniture comes in. Furniture account effect. And as per rules of real account, debit what comes in, so furniture comes in. So furniture account debit. And cash goes out. Cash account credit as per rules of real account credit board goes out. So for each account debit one thousand to cash account one thousand. So furniture comes in. So furniture account debit one thousand, and cash goes out. So cash account credit one thousand. So here furniture increased.
and cash goes out so cash decreased we have cash 1 lakh out of 1 lakh cash 1000 for nature purchase so 1 lakh minus 1000 because cash decreased to 1000 so 1 lakh minus 1000 that is 99000 so cash 99000 stock here nothing is changed in your stock same 4000 Debtors, so there is no change in your debtors. Same. Now here we purchase the furniture, so furniture is our new asset. One thousand. No change in your capital.